our device offers an alternative to traditional animal testing, which is testing done on mice or rats, which is faster, cost-effective, ethical, and better than the current in vitro alternatives, which are typically done on cellular models. They cannot provide complete answers at the whole organism level. The model organism used in our device for safety and efficacy testing of substances is a tiny one millimeter long worm called C. elegans. But the problem of C. elegans research today is that it strongly relies on manual operations and visual inspection by trained operators, which are clear obstacles for the commercialization and the widespread use of this model in the industry. So the revolution we aim to bring with this device relies on the whole automation of the process of C. elegans culture, treatment with compounds of interest, and analysis. Our team at EPFL developed a new technology building on microfluidics, which is the manipulation of fluids at the micrometric scale, as an innovative tool to confine the worms in dedicated micro compartments and then cartridge to be plugged in the machine that handles the whole process of the worm culture, treatment and analysis and extracts results about the safety and efficacy of the compounds. Our current prototype is operational and has been already used in collaboration with both academic and industrial partners for testing of their own compounds and for their own research. It allows today testing up to 32 uh, conditions in parallel, but we're scaling up this technology, uh, aiming to get next generation prototype uh, where we can test up to 96 conditions in parallel uh, to be used actually in a, in a large scale industrial perspective for testing safety and efficacy of pharmaceutical, chemical and cosmetic compounds.